Hi, this is Nathan, your neighborhood arcade and pinball talk guy. We're going to be reviewing Clown Remake today on Zakaria through Steam. Please look for our review under the description of the video, as well as like and follow us on our social media formats, arcade and pinball talk, under Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, as well as click that YouTube subscribe button. Anyway, let's get this review underway, shall we? Very colorful table right out the gate. I am scared of clowns. Not in that way, but just don't like them. I will say the game, so far, is exactly what you would expect from a game titled Clown. I will say that I wasn't a fan of the retro or the SS games of uh, Zacharias Clown. This one has a lot more going on. Very high block to the middle. So you basically have your blocks and your lanes going to the back of the table where the pop bumpers are. And so it's very heavy to the center of the table to keep your ball back to your flippers to the front. Anyway, you have your multipliers. Uh, you have your balloon, coin, cake, course card, unicycle. Those are your modes. Uh, everything's lit up. Color looks good. Theme is what it would be for a clown. You know, blown a trombone. And that's original artwork from some of the other tables, too. Uh, flipper gap's not bad. Table mechanics, in lane to the left and right. You have two in lanes to the right, one to the left. Two exit lanes to the left, one exit lane to the right. You have a lane that goes up uh, through the left side of the table to the back uh, to your pop bumpers. You have some spinners going back uh, to where the pop bumpers are as well. Uh, you have a spinner to the middle that goes back to where the pop bumpers are. And there's actually a flipper behind that. If you can't see that, you will see it shortly. Targets to the right of that. You have a ramp to the right that comes out and will have a trail to your end lane to the right. Uh, you have another lane that goes all the way around and wraps around this mess, which is basically an orbit from the looks of it. Targets down below that. That's pretty much it. The hard part is getting past all those pegs. So there's the spinner, and that's a loopy. I call it a loopy because guess what? It just looped right back at you. It's like a dang boomerang. Boom, right back at you. There's your ramp. Going to exit to the end lane to the right. There's your loopy. There's your loopy. Trying to backhand it up that ramp, but uh, obviously you got to hit it with your left flipper. You do have a kick back to the outside left lane. All in all, not a bad table for what it is. Uh, moderate gameplay. Replayability is okay on this. There's just a lot going on. And I think that it's blocked quite heavily to the front of the table. I, I'm not a big fan of that. It kind of, see, I keep hitting the, 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 the posts and the pegs. Uh, I'm not a big fan of doing it that way. It's kind of like Black Knight. It makes it very hard. You're basically battling the front of this table, uh, trying to get to the back, which is okay. That adds a layer of difficulty. Some people may like it. That's just my personal opinion. Uh, other than that, fun factors there. Not bad. Check it out. Look for our description. Uh, of, under the description, our review will be under there with our metrics. Please click subscribe, follow us, share this. Uh, anyway, thank you for watching. We look forward to our next video with you guys.